Very nice to have you here. Um, first, let me turn it to the audience. I know there's some questions. There we go. Hi, Tyler. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Tyler, I just wanted to ask you, what does it feel for you uh, to perform a song like with you yeah. that means a lot to you mm. on such a big stage like this one? As, as most of you know, uh, With You, I wrote for my wife. It's a very personal song. Um, so have, to have it on a scale like this on the Juno stage, uh, it's an incredible feeling. I, I remember when I was playing, I looked over to her and she was crying. So... I was holding back tears myself. Um, it's, it's, it's wonderful, yeah. yeah. Rudy. Tyler, how you doing, man? Good, how are you, man? I'm good. So when we were on the red carpet, one of the first questions I asked you was about doing this performance, yeah. and you said that, you know, big, scary. Yeah. So what exactly was the experience like for you getting up there and doing it, as, as you mentioned, seeing your wife and how she felt, and then getting off that stage. That was like the quickest three minutes. Within a three minute period, I met Sting. I uh, had to burp really bad before going on the performance. I had to tune my guitar, because Sting told me to. Um, and uh, when, then, yeah, I did the performance, and it's like, now I'm here, holy shit, what's going on? Like, I don't know. Um, it, it was an incredible experience. Yeah, 100%. I'll do it again, let's go. That's a good energy. I love it. Yeah. Um, your single with you that was released in July, it passed one million YouTube views in three weeks. What was that like? That is by far my fastest growing song um, to date. So yeah, it, it was pretty surreal to have that happen. I think we have over 12, 12 and a half million views uh, wow. currently. So within a six month period. That's amazing. Um, yeah. And then we have, I made a, uh, a wedding video of uh, actual footage from our wedding for the song, a wedding version. And that already has, uh, I think it's really close to a million views in just under a month. So it's, people are relating to this, you know. I, I'm, I'm seeing people put it as their wedding songs and their engagement songs. It's, uh, it's very humbling and, and I'm honored, honestly, yeah. That's very cool. Howard. Hey, Tyler. Howard hey. from SoCan. Just wondering, do you think that uh, uh, being vulnerable in your songs is what is bringing people to uh, respond so strongly to what you're doing? I think if you write songs that are, are real and relatable, you know, I don't, I go in and I just write what I feel and write whatever's on my heart or on my mind on that day. Um, and thankfully people are able to, to relate to the lyrics that I have, um, which means a lot to me, so, yeah. We have a question here, third row. Kelly, there's a mic coming to you. Congrats Thank you. on everything. Now, a uh, question for you. Your old roommate, your old friend, actually inspired you to kind of start all of this with the Much Music, yeah. Coca-Cola covers. Do you still talk to him? Yeah, he was my best man at the wedding, actually. Really? Yeah, yeah okay. we're best friends, yeah. So do you kind of uh, give him a little bit of credit when it comes to all of your success? He kind of gave you that push to... It's funny, because he's he's um, he just did his master's in psychology. So he's like the guy I talk to the most. Uh, whenever like things are going to shit or like things are happy, like he's just a good person to talk to, and he pushes me uh, to the next level uh, when it comes to uh, creating and stuff. He's like always believing in me, so he's been there since day one for sure. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you, Tyler. Thank you very much for coming yeah. down. Have a Thanks great so evening. Much. Take care.